All right, so you're wondering how much it costs to live in Boca Raton, Florida. Well, this video is gonna be all about the cost of living right here in sunny South Florida, and we're getting into it right now. What's up everyone, it's Tanner, your South Florida Realtor, and I'm doing so many videos about what it's like to eat, live, work, sleep, and play right here in South Florida. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and tap the little bell so you get notified every time I do a new video. So we're gonna be talking about housing, food, utilities, all of that stuff, but first I wanna set a level starting point, and we're gonna call that 100. 100 will represent the national average, so anything above 100 is gonna be more expensive than the national average, and anything below 100 is gonna be cheaper than the national average. And I think a good starting point is just gonna be overall cost of living in Boca Raton, so everything all included, Boca Raton comes in at 121. Yeah, it's a little bit more expensive than the national average, but I think there's one main driving factor Factor, pushing that number up a little bit and that's gonna be housing now before we get into cost of housing I want to pull the map up real quick because something to keep in mind about Southeast Florida is that we're sandwiched in between the Atlantic Ocean to the east and the Everglades and wetlands to the west so even if you're all the way out here in the West Boca area close to the wetlands you're still less than a 30 minute drive to the beach so like I said a minute ago the big driving factor for cost of living in Boca Raton is gonna be housing Boca comes in at 147.7, which sounds really high, but if you compare it to somewhere like New York at 294, or even California at 239, it's not really that bad. And it also depends on what kind of lifestyle you want. You can find a 715 square foot condo for around $45,000, or you can find a 27,000 square foot home for around $20 million. But your median price range for a house in Boca Raton is gonna be around 350,000. Another thing to consider if you are planning on moving down here but you're looking for something a little bit more affordable is there are a lot of neighboring cities right around Boca Raton that are very nice and they actually come in below the national average. When it comes to food, Boca Raton is a little bit above that national average, coming in with a score of right around 110. But one of the many reasons why I love South Florida so much is the diversity. We have some of the best Latin food, we have some of the best Caribbean food, Italian, seafood, anything you could ever want, and we have the full range of pricing down here. You can easily go straight down to the beach, find a meal for $100, get a fine dining experience, or you could just as easily find a local mom and pop place and get a meal for $15. Next we have utilities, and surprisingly enough, Boca Raton comes in below the national average at 96.4. So the only explanation that I have for this is that we don't really need to heat our homes down here. It only gets down into the 40s a few nights out of the year, and from my experience living down in Florida my whole entire life, even when it is 40 degrees outside, your house, you turn the AC off, and it only gets to around the mid to high 60s inside. So for internet, you're probably gonna be looking right around the 40 to $65 a month range, depending on what company and what speed you get. Now, Florida isn't really known for having the best public transportation, but if you aren't coming down here with a car, you can get a monthly bus pass for around $70, and our gas prices down here are pretty cheap at $2.27 a gallon. I have people reaching out to me every single day that are considering moving down here, and I absolutely love it. So if you're even considering moving or relocating to South Florida, you've got to give me a call, shoot me a text, send me an email, message me on Facebook, however you want to get a hold of me, because I got your back when moving to South Florida. 